Climate change and pollution of our environment are probably the biggest challenges that humanity faces today. In order for us to tackle these challenges, we need to be able to accurately measure key environmental parameters such as air and water quality so as to better understand and inform measures that scientists and engineers are taking to improve the world around us. Our environmental science program specifically focuses on developing students with the technical skills and the knowledge required to make accurate and reliable scientific measurements of the environment around us. Our unique laboratory facilities incorporate advanced scientific instrumentation used in industry and research to measure parameters such as the acidity and oxygen content in water or the levels of harmful chemicals in our atmosphere. Here in this lab we test water quality, we test it for various purposes. For instance, if we wanted to release water into the environment, we would check it for dissolved oxygen levels to make sure that the oxygen level is correct, that we don't affect the aquatic life. We also check water to make sure it's suitable for drinking, we would check pH levels, we would check conductivity levels, and we also have the capability of checking water to make sure it's suitable for pharmaceutical processing, or what's good for water quality is also good for a whole load of other liquid processing as well. We also go through the effectiveness of filtration and other process steps, so we look at when municipal water is taken in from a source, how it's developed, how it's processed, how it's filtered, at the end of the line you get water that's suitable for drinking and suitable for, for your use at home. We are particularly interested in monitoring air quality. Air quality is a difficult measurement and we measure various pollutants and their concentration levels in the air. So our students get hands-on practice in terms of this challenging measurement. So we measure certain pollutants such as SO2, NOx, NO2, particulate matter. Really, we are particularly interested in the quality control. The EPA have a network of monitoring stations throughout the country. It's very important that people and students, when they look at the data, that they have confidence in the data. Now I'm working on my final year project, which is, which is based on the Raspberry Pis along with EnviroPlus sensors. So what I basically do is monitor air quality in terms of temperature, humidity, and particulate matter. And once I get the data, I will do some data analysis and try to see how accurate that whole kit is with some reference instruments here that we have on campus. This project is sponsored by the Irish EPA and the Scottish EPA. Any results that I get will be shared with them. So these sensors are actually low cost and they suit secondary school students. So they can actually upload their data so that they can contribute to the, to the science world. For the Generation Change campaign, I would strongly urge students to have a look at a wonderful website. It's called airquality.ie. On this website, they can see the network of air quality monitoring stations that's set up by the EPA. And you can go and you can check the air quality in your local area.